This is Sherry Veronica. And whether you realize it or not, you are. Whether you see yourself in this category or not, you are. You are not it. If you're living on this earth, you are an addict. We all are. Okay? So when you see that person with the needle, with the drugs running around the house, you know, seeing invisible people and you're saying, oh, he's on drugs. You are also. You are on drugs also. You use sugar. And that is one of the biggest drugs. You have your cell phone in your hand constantly. You take your kids and you leave them all places, all over the place, but you never leave your cell phone anywhere. You are addicted to your cell phone. You're listening to me right now on your cell phone. You're addicted to the cell phone. People are addicted to lies. People are addicted to the lies. Some people love to lie. They love it. They're addicted to it. Some people are addicted to church. They go to church and they say, I never miss a Sunday. I never miss a Saturday. Some people are addicted to their Bible. Imagine walking around with Jack and Jill went up the hill as a name of a book in your hand for 75 years, 50 years. Imagine having Jack and Jill books all over your house saying that is the book that you worship. Imagine having a math or science book, one book in your hand and walking around with it for eons eons you'll be crazy but you don't feel that way when you're walking around with the bible when you're holding that bible really tight and walking around with it and reading the same pages of it every day day and you do not think that you're crazy you're addicted you are addicted to the bible you are addicted to believing in a god something that you can't see you it's an that is an addiction it's all addictions so when you are looking at the ones who are falling down and who are sick, physically sick, because you can see them in the street or you may hear about them or they may be hospitalized. You, you are addicted to, you have your addictions to anything that you use as a crutch, anything, even love. People are addicted to being in love and hearing the word love or somebody loves me or you love someone. You don't love anyone. Because love does not have any expectations. You cannot expect anything to come from love if you really love someone. You do not love. It's just a crush. It's just something you say to someone to soften them. It's like black magic. If you tell someone you love them, they think, well, maybe if they love me, I can get something from them. And you think that if you say you love them, maybe they can soften. You can get something from them. It's, it's a game. It's a game. You're all addicted. And like I said, whoever said, judge not for ye also could be judged. But the same way you are judging someone, those same parameters can be used to judge you. Judge not. Judge not. Because you're all, if you are on the earth, if you are living on this earth, you are not it. You are addicted to something. You have some sort of fear. It all comes from fears. Everyone has fears. That's why you reach for your phone. That's why you reach for your coffee. That's why you reach for that sugar, that salt. That's why you go to church. That's why you get married. That's why you have to have a boyfriend. And he has to be, you have to know exactly where he is at all times. That's not, you start to feel insecure. You're all addicted, all addicted to your lies and to your, the illusions and to the, the, the makeup stories you make. You, you just make up stories all the time. You are addicted you are addicted to the life that you are living. You are not it. You do not need to be pushing a needle in your vein. You do not need to be smoking any substances, as they call it. No, just drinking all that sugar every day. Just eating all that fried chicken every day. Just eating that mac and cheese every day. Just being, just being, and just having crutches and things that you say you need and you must have living outside of moderation you are addicted you are an addict call no one call no one an addict because it's a hypocritical way to live you yourself are what you see outside in front of you anything you see in in front of you that's you that's you you're all addicts Shave Veronica.